Yeah. Oh, you got one? Yeah. I got one exactly the same time, man. Oh, it's a twofer. It's a twofer. We got a twofer. <laughs> After a slippery hike, we arrive at Pickerton. Hello everyone on Clash's channel. Creek. See it? All right, so we're getting all geared up here on Pickerton. Um, basically, this place, if you haven't seen any of Dan's videos, it's all bedrock, just like this. This kind of terrain is ideal to prospect for gold. All these little divots and crevices and everything. Today I'm going to be using the Mine Lab STC 2300, and I just started detecting around, and I got a target right here. I also have the Mine Lab ProFind 35, and there's my target. It's a nail. Um, I know there's a lot of nails around here, so we're going to be getting a lot of finding a lot of these. There are lots of pickers here. So this will be an interesting day. Big piece of wire. So at least I know the detector's working just fine. I did find a bullet casing here, big rim fire one. Little piece of wire, little piece of iron and stuff. But I think I'm gonna go ahead and just take my pan and classifier and just do a few hasty pans just to get a little bit of gold. This stuff is all a lot of sand, and then underneath there's a lot of broken like bedrock and stuff. And I did find a piece of metal here, so I know that the heavies are dropping out here at least. Okay, let's go pan this out. There's even there's even more stuff down here I'd like to get. Maybe we'll do two pans out of here. Here's what our tailings look like. They're basically like little razor blades, all shale, just super sharp pieces. But that's perfect for that little gold to get trapped in there. All right, let's pan it out and see what we get here. Left hand panning. When you're filming, you have to be ambidextrous for the better shot. All right, let's see what we got here. I didn't get very much in that pan, just a little bit of flower gold. So, that means I gotta dig a little bit deeper. <laughs> wow, <laughs> that's really good for one, <laughs> for one uh, hasty pan. Get it on camera. All right, so we got flower gold here, 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 all around. Pretty good for just a quick hasty pan. Little pieces of gold over here too. No pickers yet, but that's, Dan already found uh, two pickers. This is pretty good. All right, so I've just been working in this area right here, but Dan came over and brought a pan over. I didn't have the camera with me, but he showed me he had two pickers and him and Polly are up past that rock right there. So we're gonna go up there with the uh, SDC and see if we can find some nuggets up there. So we're on like a really rocky slope here. Yeah on the north end of the Pickerton claim. Paul, you don't have that filter in your pocket, do you? I do. All right. Thanks. Nice. So, uh, yeah, uh, I've now picked two out of here. Um, I, I detected one that was sitting sort of up here when there was rocks here, and Polly detected two down here. Right so, in this little area. So this crack is definitely producing, and the fact that the water would be running down here and then mm -hmm. draining, Really this whole area. I think this whole trough down here is worth worth, worth it. And I'm just going to continue this up just because I'm I'm hitting it. Might as well continue. This is really cool. So I'm over here with Davey. Um, I'm playing around with the SDC 2300. I'm getting a signal down here in this really tiny, tiny crevice. And we're blasting it apart with the pickaxe. I don't think it's anything other than gold. Oh, you said, you said it out loud. I think it is gold. Yeah, whatever it is, it needs to be dug up. That is true. What? Oh my goodness, really? Piece of can slaw. 
That's the only other thing that could have been fit that could have been jammed down been in, there. in that little crack. Yep. Bald eagle, yeah. Dan found a nothing pan here. Oh, yeah. So uh, there's like 40 or 50 little pieces, one medium one. But, yeah, that's really good. But there's no uh, big pickers in it, so I'll suck that up. But yeah, you got flower gold here, here, flakes. I would call that flakes. This is all flower. Wow. Yeah. Nice. Nice. Also, I got a new announcement here. Um, brand new Plush Guitars t-shirts. They got the Colorado flag with the, you know, the logo and everything. Uh, these are a limited run over on Bonfire. They're only gonna be available for about a week. Yeah, link in the description if you're interested. Whoa. All right, let's see if we've got anything in this pan. A couple pieces of flower gold. Got like five five little flecks of flower gold up there. So I'm gonna move spots. I'm not gonna stay up there. I'm just gonna find a pick a crevice and we're gonna clean it out. That's the next thing we're doing. So we're all making some progress here. Dan's working this area. Dan's dad is just below. He just found a picker. Davey is just moving this bedrock all over the place. Oh my goodness. Yeah, I wow. Think, I think there's a little guy washed back too. Dad, Dan, Dad. Dad, Dad, Dad. You just, you just be good. You just be good. So Dad, right after Dad, the first one, yeah. gets a second. Said, and all the cameras come out because it's a nice one. As I said, I think the uh, better stuff is in the bucket. Oh, that is a nice picker. That's crazy. Sweet. <laughs> and everyone's camera. Gotta come out to check out the new picker. So this place is absolutely crazy. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and just pick a crevice this time. I'm gonna take this crevice right here and clean it all the way down to bedrock. And there's gotta be something in it. Here we go. Pretty well cleaned out here the material I'll go pen this and see if we got anything a lot of moss and stuff but we're right down to bedrock there oh yeah finally got a piece yeah oh you got one I got one exactly the same time man it's a twofer. We got a twofer. There in the middle. Oh, right over there. There you go. I didn't even pan it back yet, and there you go. That one's thick. Oh yeah. It's not a nugget, but I call it a nuggy because oh, you know, yeah. it's thick. Awesome. I got a little piece there too. I'm gonna have to pan this yeah. out a little better. Yeah, man. And there's a nice flake in there too. A little nuggy. Says he's got something good in his pan too. Yeah. Now I got the picture. Not only that, come on over here. This is the biggest piece of gold I think I have ever found. The biggest piece of gold, Shane Clash. Yeah. Do people actually call you Clash? Clash. That's my. I wife. call you Clash all the time. You call me Clash. That's it. The yeah. biggest piece of felt gold Clash I, has ever I, found. I think so. I'm pretty sure it's at, a picker. At I the mean, Pickerton claim. Yeah. Shane thinks he found his biggest piece of gold. Yeah. Nice. And you can pick and it right up. We That's... got a two for both of us at the same time. I'm happy with that, man. Oh, yeah. Awesome. Clash's first picker from Pickerton. Now we're on it, guys. Yeah, Maybe you gotta find one. The rest of us have. Here is the picker crevice. And just when I thought I was done, where I got those three pickers from, I picked this out of the bottom. So there's all that delicious clay stuff right there. I guarantee we're gonna find more gold in there. Polly's up there playing around with the SDC 2300. How you doing with it, man? Any luck? You, drop something in your pan. you have to drop something in my pan. Okay, Polly wants to put something in my pan, and I'm not sure what's going to happen here. Is he going to jump at me? Maybe. No, He's going to bite me. No. <laughs> oh, big lead sinker. 
Wow. Was, was your metal detector enough to pick that up? Well, mine, uh, mine didn't read uh, it at the surface at all. So this one actually got right down to it. So. It's a hey, Paulia, are you picking? Oh, that was it. That was, uh, yeah, everyone pulls out the cameras. Yeah, yeah all the cameras. Come. So I keep just digging up like trash targets and whatever, and I decide not to film it. And of course, finally, holy cow! A well, nice, he's got a piece. nice fat piece. That is awesome. Oh, really cool. That's a beauty. That is. A nice close up on that one. That's. I'd say it's probably 18 ounces. <laughs> that's fat though, too. Eh? Look how fat it is. That's pretty cool. Yeah, that's a, that's a gra yeah. that's a grammar Bram. easy. You sure? Oh yeah. Oh, yeah. Who knows? I do. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Fair enough. I have nice, a scale man. back in my truck. Cool. That is actually pretty cool. Yeah, you yeah. don't even look very happy. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm I'm pretty happy. I am always happy. I, I take finding gold for granted, man. I mean, I gotta appreciate more of that. That is awesome. beautiful, man. That is awesome. Oh, I'm gonna take a close up of that. Yeah, feel free. Hey, look. Yeah, he's got he's got a nugget down here. Yeah. That wasn't even in the water. It wasn't even sniping. Nana! Okay. Alright, let's uh... See if you moved it out? Yeah, let's just see what we did here. Two, three little specks. Yeah. So I think it was the rock just ironized or something. So we're having a lot of fun out here at Pickerton. We're here for a couple hours now. Um, I'm still learning the STC 2300. I didn't find any gold with it yet. Okay, so I'm detecting uh, right up in here. I found a piece of iron and Polly's over here cooling off because it is pretty warm out today. Um, a lot of walking up and down these rocks. It kind of gets sweated up a little bit. Dan, how you doing, man? Can you see that from there? Oh yeah. He's been, he's been picked by Pickerton. Yay, I never leave this clay without spilling blood. I got a couple little cuts, but. I just touched, I nicked the rock, tiny. They're like razors, they really are. I've been here for way too long, about a half hour or so, and I have all these tailings that I was yanking out of this crevice. So there was heavy stuff in there, a couple pieces of iron. I'm gonna take all that stuff, we're gonna pan it out and see if there's any gold in it. All right, so I'm working on this crevice right here. I got a nice pan of material for it right there. So this is unclassified right here. I'm gonna go ahead and just wash this off and get most of the overburden off by hand without a classifier. I'm sinking. The Fraser River is eating me alive. This can be done without a classifier if you do it that way. You just pan it like normal. Take your overburden, your big stuff, and just kind of pick it off with your fingers. It's a lot easier with a classifier though. A lot quicker. Don't see any gold yet. Let's spin it around here and see if we got anything. So this was from that bottom half of that crevice. Oh my goodness, dude, holy cow! I got a twofer. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Look at this, man. Oh yeah, what's up? And there's no flower gold, it's just two big chunks. Shane just found two big chunks of gold. Out of that one crevice, man. Actually three, this is the third picker. Third Them, picker. Yeah, two and three. Wow. Dude. Good for you, man. So High happy. five. High five. Nice, right? Yeah, that is nice. That's a folded one. A foldy. Yeah. That one's like folded over. I hope I'm getting that on camera. I love it here. Yeah. One of these is folded over, and this other one's just, I mean, oh, that's a fat little piece, too. It's yeah, it not is. exactly super thin. Yeah, that's so cool, man. That's a folded over piece. That's sweet. It's like folded in half. See that? It's awesome. Nothing to see here. I came back from my getting the water, and all the cameras are out. <laughs> Come on down, Dan. Check it out. This is you, Shane. This is me. Out of that. Oh, wall. Yeah. At, this is from that crevice right below that one where you found your your one or your dad, I think. It's two pieces. Another twofer. Another, that was two in that one pan. Very bottom of the crevice in that clay when you scrape it out mm -hmm. at the very bottom. That clay is holding it for sure. Yeah. Nice. Look at the depth on this thing. 
I got three pickers out of it already. I'm still not at the bottom. And right there, I'm gonna pan that out and see what we can get. That's pretty much from the bottom of the bottom of the bottom of the crevice. How you doing, Dan? I'm doing really well. I guaranteed him there'd be gold in there, so if there's not, I'm gonna refund all of his money. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so I am still working on this crevice. Get a good shot of the, the depth of it. As you can see, this thing is, it's pretty deep. You can't even see the bottom, and I'm still not really at the bottom. I pulled this much more material out of it after I thought I was almost done. So let's go pan this out. I've already found three pickers in it. I think Dan said he found a three or four gram nugget here. So, gotta check. Okay, let's pan this stuff down and see what we get here. This should be the most exciting pan of the day so far. Let's see what we got here. Just hold my boot. Oh yeah, nice big piece. Can you see that? What's going on down here? Million views. Here we come. Holy shit! Oh my goodness, dude. Wow. <laughs> I have to tell you, man, you're pretty brave with that fucking camera. Look at this thing, guys! <laughs> Holy cow! Okay, Flash. You guys can you can come what do you down. Have, Flash? Just a little piece of flower gold. <coughs> oh, I can see it from a mile oh, away. Oh my goodness! I, I, I think Polly's Polly Polly beat me. I think, but this one is probably the second. That is a nice piece of gold. Look at that, man! It's, it's shaped like a. Like a country or something, yes. Which country? I'm not entirely sure. Czechoslovakia. The That's bottom it. of your crevice. Yeah. There's, it's, I'm still not done with that crevice yet. <laughs> <laughs> That's crazy, man. Someone has a really big smile on his face. That's so awesome. Mm. It is tasty. Mm. Yummy. All right, guys. Well, we're here at Pickerton, and we've been here for two minutes. Two minutes, exactly. We've been here for about nine hours. And uh, we got a lot of gold. We're gonna show it all. Um, I think we're gonna show it all. Yeah. Yeah, we're gonna yeah. show it all. <laughs> um, I got a target up here with the gold bug. Pickerton strikes for the first time on me. Yeah, I got a nice, I got a nice one there. And um, yeah, we had a lot of fun. Thanks a lot, Dan. I really appreciate you inviting me up here to British Columbia. Anytime you wanna make that flight, you're welcome back. Yeah, it's not that far. It's not that far. So anyway, um, next thing you guys see will be some gold. I won't make any sounds. So that is <laughs> right when I did. Duh. There we go. All right, we're back at the Airbnb, and wait, wait until you see the gold that we got. This is ridiculous. This is just absolutely crazy. Now this is all three. This is Polly. Dan and my gold right here and I put I poured my gold out to weigh it out and I actually had four I actually found four of these uh, this one here was mine I found that one Polly found this one clunk <laughs> this thing is like um what, what did that one weigh four set four one four his this one weighed mine was four one four Polly's was five, seven. Mine's five, seven, seven. Oh, okay, yeah. Cool. Polly's nugget here weighed 0 0.57. Mine weighed point, was it three, seven? No, no, point two, two seven. seven, point two, seven. Dan's big one here weighed point four one, yeah, four, four and a half ounces. <laughs> Dan's weighed point four one four. And these are all the other pickers. And as I poured mine out, these guys, poured theirs in here and they actually gave me all this gold so <laughs> that's awesome man thanks so yeah, much I gave you that too and of course Polly gave me the trash <laughs> but yeah we cleaned up a lot a couple square nails in here pieces of iron and yeah that was an awesome day